Intelligence agencies have warned the Jammu police of a plot to target the Raghunath Temple by Pakistan back terrorists. There is now a security alert across Jammu and Kashmir and security is being strengthened at multiple temples including the Vaishno Devi Shrine. The recovery of improvised explosive devices dropped by drones sent from across the border in Pakistan and the arrest of some overground workers of terrorist organizations have led to this big disclosure. India Today's Kamaljeet Kaur Sandhu gets us more in this exclusive report. The Raghunath Temple in the heart of Jammu is in the terror crosshairs again. India Today has accessed information about an intelligence alert about prominent temples in Jammu, including the famous Raghunath Temple being on the hit list of Pakistan-backed terrorists ahead of the second anniversary of the abrogation of Article 370 and Independence Day. Jammu is also known as the city of temples, being the air, rail and road hub to access the Mata Vaishno Devi Shrine at Katra. The input comes from the interrogation of some terrorists and overground workers arrested recently. इस तरह की कार्रवाइयों की प्लानिंग रहती है मगर हमारी पुलिस फोर्स और बाकी एजेंसीज मिलकर काम कर रही हैं और हमें कामयाबी मिली है पहले भी आइंदा भी इसमें कामयाबी देयर हैज बीन सीरीज ऑफ अटेम्प्ट्स टू स्मगल इन एक्सप्लोसिव्स एंड आईईडीज इनटू जम्मू देयर हैव बीन थ्री मेजर रिकवरीज एंड थ्री टेरर स्ट्राइक्स अवर्टेड in February, 7 kg's IED was recovered from the old bus stand in Jammu. In June, 5 kg's IED was recovered from Nadeem Rathar, TRF overground worker. In July, 5 kg's IED was recovered when police shot down a drone near Aknur. The security forces have heightened an alert, but the fact remains there is a new modus operandi using drones to send in weapons and the IED. The challenge will remain as to how to counter these particular threats and neutralize terrorists. On the basis of interrogation of Nadeem Rathar, two more people were taken into custody and when the three were questioned together, information about a plot to target temples in Jammu was unraveled. <laughs> Several high-profile temples in Jammu have now been put on a state of high alert. Incidentally, Pakistani terrorists have targeted the Raghunath Temple even earlier in 2002, where 13 devotees lost their lives and more than 50 were injured in the suicide attack. With Kamaljeet Sandhu in Jammu, Bureau Report, India Today. And India Today, Sunil Ji Bhatt now joins me live from Jammu on this big story. Sunil Ji, as this report indicated, the Raghuna Temple has been targeted by Pakistani terrorists of the Jaish e Mohammed and Lashkar e Taiba even in the past. There have been attempts made at other temples too. How credible is this intelligence report and what's the action that's being taken on ground? Well, Gaurav, as you said, that Raghunath Temple has been attacked by the terrorists in the past also. In 2002, uh, this temple was attacked twice. And after that, the security was beefed up. But now, uh, there is intelligence input that uh, this temple may be attacked again by the terrorists. And not just this temple, but other prominent temples in Jammu are also on the hit list of the terrorists. Gaurav, as we know that Jammu is known as the city of temples, there are many prominent temples here in Jammu city and they are always on the hit list of the terrorists and in the recent past there are reports that terrorists are desperately trying to stoke communal tension here in Jammu region where people maintain communal harmony despite what happened in Kashmir in early 90s. There is total yes. peace and harmony as far as people to people relations are concerned community to community relations are concerned but this is an eyesore for pakistan and the terrorists and that is why they want to stoke communal tension on july uh, 2 earlier this month i had spoken to the director general of jnk police dilbag singh and he confirmed to me that yes uh, temples and other important religious places in jammu are on the hit list of okay. terrorists and they are trying to ensure that no harm is caused to these temples and Communal harmony is maintained at all costs here in Jammu region. And Absolutely. Sunil ji, keep tracking that story. 
I will come back to you for more.